James Martin shocked fans this week when he was spotted out with his rumored new girlfriend Kim Johnson, the ex-wife of Aaron Nea, following a 12-year relationship with Louise Davies. According to the Mail Online, the former couple quietly parted ways in December, but are said to have remained friends. Despite being in the public eye for many years, the chef has tended to keep his love life away from the spotlight and has only spoken briefly about it in rare interviews. Little is known about his relationship with TV producer Louise, but he is believed to have met her on the set of Celebrity Who Wants to Be a Millionaire back in 2011. In 2017, he gushed over his relationship on Good Morning Britain telling the hosts he felt happy for the first time in my life. While seeming loved up however, James said he had no desire to marry her as they were fine as they were. Speaking to Sunday People, he said, I don't need to spend 60 grand on a day, no, I'm more than happy thanks. The chef has also said, due to his busy career, he had also always put having children on the back burner. In 2020, he told Prima magazine, the biggest low of my career is that I've given up everything for it. I look at my mates and they're all married with kids, and that's not the case for me because I've been so focused on work. Ahead of meeting Louise, James was in a relationship with James Bond producer Barbara Broccoli for five years. The chef met the now 63-year-old after she won a dinner cooked by him at an auction costing £18,000. In quotes obtained by Mail Online in 2008, James opened up about their romance telling readers that the pair just clicked. The Saturday Morning Star also said Barbara lavished him with gifts and offered to buy him a £180,000 Aston Martin, but turned it down out of male pride. The chef went on to say that while their 12-year age gap didn't bother him, it felt a little awkward in public. He explained, When we went to functions I felt uncomfortable when people looked at me, this nobody, and probably thought, H is with her for the money. James referred to Barbara as his first real love who he would always think the world of but believes their split was for the best. Addressing their breakup, he went on to say, Walking away from someone you love and who loves you that much is hard, adding that their split was maybe the daftest thing I have done.